Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm Bonnie the Imam, and my channel is about providing information on various products for moms and children to help moms make decisions easier. And today I will be doing a packing video for the Jujube Grab and Go um, bag in the Fantasy Paradise print. I've done a more detailed um, review and packing video that I will link to this video and in my description below, which um, talks about all the features for this bag. I won't go into the details um, in this video just so that I don't make it too long. I'm going to jump right in and show you what I have packed in the outside of the bag and then show you how I organize inside of the bag. This bag is packed with a B switch, which is a Jujube insert. So I want to show the difference of packing this type of bag with an insert versus not using one. So that's the difference in this video compared to some of my other videos. Um, in the front pocket here, um, I have a pack of tissue. I also have a phone case to show you how big my phone is, which I am using to film right now. Um, it's a Google Pixel 2. I also have a small set piece in the blush chromatics print, which goes nicely with the fantasy paradise print in my opinion. Inside I have a coin purse in the matching print and it has a change in cash inside. I also have a card holder by Jujube called the B charge and a lipstick and chapstick inside as well. And that's it for the inside of the bag. I don't have anything in the bottle pockets. Um, I put a bot I put a cup inside the bag, which I will show you. And there's no back pocket um, to this bag. So inside, I'm just going to show you how it's packed with a B switch. So the B switch is the black insert that you see. And inside I have a Wow sippy cup for my toddler. In the front two front, well it's kind of hard to show you. In the front pockets, um, right here and right here, I will pull out those two pouches. So I have a small pouch in the Unikiki 2.0 print. And this has a teething teether or teething toy for my toddler. In the other slip pocket, I have a Bumpkins Hello Kitty snack bag, which is also a small wet bag. I have some med kit items, um, vitamin E cream, band-aids, uh, tablets for headache and and moisturizer inside and this is a cute the cute colors goes well with the print as well in the middle of the B switch I have a B quick in the same print with the short strap attached to it so this has my son's diapering needs I have a hand sanitizer. I have three size three diapers in here. I have a light change pad by Jujube in the Sakura at Dust uh, print, which fits nice and compact in the Be Quick. And in the Be Quick, there is a zipper pocket, and I just have some baggies inside. So I'm going to pull out another pouch from that pocket there, from the B switch. I have a medium size pouch in a Unikiki 2.0 print. This print also looks really nice with the Fantasy Paradise print. I like the light blue colors. And this I just have a food pouch, my son's bib, and also spoons and scissors. In the B-Switch, there are two side pockets, which 
could be used as bottle pockets. I just have spare change of clothes in there for him. So a pair of pants. And on the other side, I have his uh, onesie. There is a zipper pocket inside the B-switch, and I have a nursing cover inside. I have this um, nursing cover by Toki Doki and Baby Ole. It's in the Toki Doki um, print with so many of the Toki Doki characters. I just really love this um, this nursing cover. I don't have anything in the back pocket of the B-Switch, but in the front pocket of the B-Switch, I have a wet bag by Jujubee. This is the B-Dry in the Rainbow Dreams print. And it also folds really compact um, to pack in the grab and go. For the grab and go, I try to pack smaller, thinner items so that it doesn't make the bag too heavy. Hence, I have only a small package of wipes instead of the big um, packages with like 60 counts. And that's all I have for the B-Switch pack inside the Grab and Go. I will pull out the insert to let you see what it looks like. Um, so this is what the B-Switch looks like. So super handy. I will pack it up to show you what it looks like. So I have the wet bag in the front pocket. I had the snack bag um, used as a med kit in the top pocket. There are four pockets on this side, two up, up here and two on the bottom. And then on the opposite side, just two large slip pockets. And then two side pockets as well. And the zipper compartment. So I'm just gonna stick the clothes back on the side of each pocket. Have the cup on top of the pair of pants. One of the pouches will go back inside one of the large slip pockets on the back. This pouch had the teething toy inside. diapering needs in the be quick in the middle compartment the nursing cover I had it um, tucked into the back zipper pocket I had a pack of wipes in the front slip pocket So this is everything I have packed up in the B-Switch, which fit inside the grab and go. I won't stuff it back in because I actually inserted the um, B-Switch inside the grab and go first and then packed up the bag. So I won't go and do that again, but this gives you an idea how great that the B switch actually fits into the grab and go. And I hope you found this video helpful in case you own a B switch and you want to use in the grab and go, or if you're thinking of getting a B switch to fit in the grab and go, um, there was still a little bit of space on top if you need to add a thin jacket or blanket and um, cinching the, the top 
was pretty easy. Um, so if you have any more questions or comments, please leave it down below for me. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. I would hope that you will subscribe to my channel and follow me along for future videos. And don't forget to turn on the notification button, which is the little bell beside the subscribe um, wording on YouTube so that you'll be alerted of any new videos that I will upload to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy this video. Take care. Bye.